Right now, it's time to show you some of this morning's headlines from around the globe. Britain's Guardian looks at the death of an Oscar-winning director. Malik Benjaloo won last year's Academy Award for Best Documentary for the film Searching for Sugar Man. The 36-year-old died yesterday in Sweden. No word on the cause of death this morning, but police don't suspect anything criminal. Two years ago, Bob Simon interviewed Benjaloo for 60 Minutes. The filmmaker said he shot some of the movie on his phone with an app that cost only a dollar. The Chicago Tribune says things are back to normal this morning after thousands of airline passengers were delayed Tuesday. Smoke at a local radar facility shut down flights at O'Hare and Midway airports. Over a thousand flights were canceled, creating a ripple effect nationwide. And the New York Post says actor Alec Baldwin was stopped by police yesterday for bicycling the wrong way down a street. He didn't have his ID. He went on a profane rant, they say, because the officers didn't know who he was. Baldwin was handcuffed, taken to the station, and charged with disorderly conduct, then released. He is due in court July 24th.